Hi, thanks for joining me today. My name is Tim Marvel. Hey, today uh, we're on video number 17 and 25. And I'm going to talk about something that I am a little bit, I get nervous when I talk about this because people uh, could take this the wrong way. But I need you to understand if you're going to go out in public and meet people and that's what you do for a living, regardless of what your position is, whether you're a manager, whether you're a server, whether you're a sales consultant, whatever you do, I want you to understand there's some things that are really important. People determine whether they're going to do business with you because of this. Let me just throw it out there. It's your hygiene. Now, I've talked a lot about being clean, neat, pressed, ready to go, your hair's combed, and so on. But let's go a little further. I'll tell you some things that freak me out, you know, and it's going to sound a little goofy, but I just want you to know people see this, and this is how they determine whether they want to do business with you. Do you have hair growing out of orifices? Do you... When you shave, you miss big spots. You know, do your eyebrows come out past your nose? I don't know. Guys, all these things come into play. Are you clean? You know, sometimes we paint on the weekends. Do you take the time to make sure that the paint's all off your arms and legs? You know, are our clothes, you look down at your clothes. Do you look like your clothes came out of the closet? Are they clean? You guys, if you're wearing khaki shorts in the summertime, Make sure they're clean. I can tell you, going out, you're leaning on dirty cars. They're getting dirty. Guys, if you're going to come help me, and I don't know. It could be anything from a steak to a house to a car. But if you're going to get involved and try to sell me anything, uh, you need to sell yourself first. And that means you need to be ready. So when you come to work, did you skip your shower? Do I have to worry about body odor? Guys, if you have a friend that has issues with body odor, you need to pull them to the side, be their friend, and tell them. Be helpful. Say, hey, dude, try to be fair and honest. Let me tell you, this is a concern. Your customers are probably going to feel the same way. Hey, you drink an adult beverage at night. It's summer. You walk out. It's 110 degrees on the lot. Guess what? You know what happens with alcohol? I just want everybody to understand. Your skin is porous. It's got holes in it. Basically, what happens is when you drink, it comes through the pores in your skin. You drink bourbon, you're going to smell like bourbon. I just want you to know that. Guys, I'm trying to be your friend when I tell you this. So do this. Think about your hygiene. Do you need to work on it? How about your teeth? Do you brush your teeth every day? Does your breath stink? You know, don't be the guy that ends up with a bottle of scope on his desk because he doesn't take care of himself or deodorant or should I, do I need to go on? Man, this is a little embarrassing to have to talk about. But you guys need to be aware. If I'm in a closed, confined area with you, and I have something that permeates off of me, it could turn you off and you may not want to do business with me. So do me a favor. If you got a friend, share with them. Say, hey, just trying to help you out. You know what? You can say anything with the right tone. And if you really say it sincere with a caring heart, nobody's going to take offense to it. So, hey, thanks for joining me. I want you to have a good day. And I'll talk to you soon. By the way, join me on my YouTube page, uh, Tim Marvel, or jump on my website, timmarble.com. So again, thanks. Have a great day. Talk to you soon.